Hello, I'm Pasco Pleasance, Professor of Empirical Legal Studies at UCL and Convener of Law and Social Inquiry. Law and Social Inquiry is unique among your options. First, it gives you an opportunity to learn and think about how law operates in the real world through the lens of the social sciences, such as psychology, epidemiology, anthropology, education, geography, economics, and political science. All disciplines you will find represented at UCL, but all disciplines that are generally thought of as being distant to law. Second, the course gives you an opportunity to undertake your own project to address an empirical question of particular interest, or let's call it a pilot project to take the pressure off. To get you into the swing of things, in Term 1 there are a number of seminars in which world experts discuss empirical questions at the heart of their research, such as, do the public understand the laws they live by? Do legal problems make you ill? How reliable is witness testimony? What does modern day slavery look like? Will the judiciary ever be representative of the population? Can computers replace judges? These seminars provide insight into the research process and also inspiration for your project choices. A further series of seminars across terms one and two are designed to give you the necessary understanding and skills to pull off your project. This will involve choosing a subject area, defining an empirical research question, designing a study to obtain the data needed to address your research question, collecting the data and then reporting on what you have found. Studies can be either quantitative or qualitative, and there is no need for any prior understanding of social science research methods or forms of analysis. So what does the course offer? Well, as well as challenging you to look at the world of law in a different way, it will also see you develop new skills to produce and critically evaluate new forms of evidence. Skills that will inform and support you in whatever direction you ultimately choose to go. And although the course has only been running for a short while, and is relatively small, it is already clear that students find it particularly rewarding. Here are some testimonials. And if you're worried that producing a long essay, or project report as we'll call it, will be difficult, it will be. But then so is surfing, or going to the moon. And like surfing, the course will reward you for your efforts. And you will be well supported throughout, which is why marks have been high. So to end, and to give you some ideas of how you might unlock your interests and potential, here are some examples of projects that previous students have undertaken. The legal and social limits of freedom of expression in social media. Graffiti and rule following. The association between the ethical codes revealed within the television drama Suits and those subscribed to by viewers. Public understanding of trust in the banking regulatory system. Student understanding of consent in sexual relationships. Online data privacy. The representation of drug use in the media. The impact of equalities legislation. Attitudes towards standing only areas in top flight football. Cohabitation across three European countries. So there really is no limit to the topics that you can choose. It comes down to you and your interests. I hope to meet you soon.